Okay, we are recording. All right, so the reason why I wanted to do a Zoom tonight is because there's a couple reasons. Um, first of all, I just got back from Canada today and I wanna share some of that with you guys, um, but I also wanna help everybody and I, I will try to make this as quick as possible um, for the simple fact that it is Sunday night and Sunday night is always our biggest push night of the week because that's going to determine what your check is on Tuesday. And what I have to say every single week, guys, is this. Um, if you're not happy with what your check is on Tuesday, you can change it next Tuesday. Okay. Um, and there's always ways to get that check up. And the biggest way is going to be um, when you go and you help people get VIP 800, VIP 1600, you start creating those 4Ks on your team. Um, when you start getting people having success on your team, your check is going to reflect that. Okay. Um, and if there's nothing else that you've ever listened to that I say, I promise you VIP 800, VIP 1600 is your golden egg and being able to teach that to other people and get that $500 in their pocket is going to be the key to your success and the key to so many other people finding the way and making this happen. Um, I'll get to that here in just a second, Brittany. Um, so the, the biggest thing is, um, that you guys are going to find is that you're going to see people on these trips, okay? And the reason why we kind of, I wanted to start this video off in the Zoom off tonight was about the whole Mexico and Duo is because Duo will change your guys' businesses. Um, we're gonna get into that a little bit. I'm gonna talk about how you guys can get those customers. Um, I'm gonna challenge you guys all to go out and get 100 free customer accounts. And the reason why you want free customer accounts, I mean, sure, you want some of those customers to start ordering, but when the duo is released, you want those customers to all get that email that it's out, okay? You wanna start talking to them. Um, I know some of you guys might be thinking, oh, free customers, what is that going to do for my business? What is it going to do for your business? Those customers are locked into you. They're gonna get the email, they're going to see the things. If you're connecting with those people that are signing up for free customer accounts and getting them to watch the Thrive experiences on the Lavelle fan page, if you are getting them connected with a three-day mini, and then they've tried the product, they're watching the stories, and then they get an email about this amazing duo release and they start seeing those testimonies on Facebook. You don't think they're gonna want that? Of course they are. So who are they gonna come to? The person that they're already signed up on a free account with, right? You wanna build those relationships. So I'm gonna challenge all of you guys to get 100 free accounts before the end of the month. Who's up to the challenge? I know it's a crazy number, right? But here's the thing. If you divide it up by days of how many days we have left in the month, that's what, five days? Okay, so do you wanna push for 20 a day? I mean, seriously. I mean, really, it's, it's like, yes, it's a challenge, but I'm gonna to try to do it. So it's up to you guys if you're gonna to try to do it. All day the 26th, all day the 27th, all day the 28th, all day the 29th, all day the 30th. You have five full days, right? So that's 20 accounts a day. And I know that sounds like a ridiculous number, but guess what? People play duck, duck, goose. People play bingo. People play all kinds of stuff. You guys get creative. Like I promise you, you can get those free customer accounts because here's this. How many people do you know that, that want energy? If you just posted that, how many people do you think would comment on if you talked about a coffee, if you talked about this, you talked about that? People are going to comment. People are going to ask you, how do you get more energy? All right. Who wants to know about the best weight loss product or not even weight loss product, but just the most demand product on the market. Like seriously, guys, our team as a whole did $100,000 in sales in one and a half days of this release. Like if we can do that, can you imagine what your business is going to do when it's available to everybody every day? And now we have the ingredients and we have the testimonies. That's huge. That is huge. It's not just, oh, this sounds like a good idea. Now we're seeing what it's doing. Like myself, I've dropped two pant sizes just since I started using Duo. That's ridiculous. And I've eaten a lot of bread, which is not good. Don't yell at me, Aaron. <laughs> but seriously, uh, especially after Toronto, like I, ugh, I ate all bad. Um, but you guys, this, whenever yesterday I went to a VIP event in Toronto, which by the way, any of you all could get on to get to that. Okay. It's not about the rank. It's about, we had to have 12 customers and 12 promoters in a matter of three months. All right. That's what we had to do to qualify. Pretty awesome. Right. We went to this fancy like dinner 
and had free drinks and Paul talked and Drew talked and um, there was music playing like wedding music. I don't know. It was really nice. though. It was really elegant. And like we had to dress up, we got on a bus. We didn't know where we were going or anything. And we go and Paul's like, listen, you guys, the reality of this is, it's like every single one of you guys can be in Mexico. And that's why I wanted to talk to you because if you're telling yourself that you can't get to Mexico now, you're not going to be in Mexico. If you're telling yourself, I can't even sign a customer, I can't even sign a promoter, then you're not going to sign any customers and you're not going to sign any promoters because you don't have the belief in yourself. And if you don't have the belief in yourself, you're not going to have the belief in other people. I swear, I promise you that when you start believing in you, that's whenever things change. And then whenever you start believing in other people, they believe you. And then that's when things change. That's when lives change. That's whenever you truly believe 100% that you absolutely can help somebody. That is whenever your business starts to grow. That's whenever you start getting customers. That's whenever people start sending you testimony after testimony after testimony. That's when your promoters start telling you how much they are changing their lives because their check is paying this bill, that bill. They're able to go to the grocery store. You guys, I want every single one of you to experience those messages from your team, the people that you brought in. And I can tell you this, I would be nothing without all of you guys. All right. I work my ass off. Like there's no sugarcoating it. Excuse my language, but there is no sugarcoating it. Every second of every day, I am answering messages, calls, Zooms. I don't care. I love doing it. Lisa and I sat out front yesterday at the VIP event and we were just talking. I said, you know, it's rare that you find people that just want to work. And that's all I could wait to get back to. I couldn't wait to get back because I want to see you guys hit your goals. You know, I hit my goal March 24th of this year. I hit my goal in this company, but guess what? I had to set a new goal. I couldn't just sit there and say, this is my goal. My goal now is to see each person that wants to go to 200 K see them hit 200 K each person that wants to earn that car bonus, earn that car bonus. I don't care who I signed, who they signed. I just want to help the people that want it. And the people that show up, the people that continue to show up. And I have to tell you, I was talking to somebody this weekend and I talked to them about how we have a zero negativity on our team page. Zero, none. Don't tolerate it. Anybody that's on my team in the past, anybody that's on my team in the present, they know if I see something negative on the page, delete it, no warning, don't care. Why? Because the business isn't ran in negative land. All right? Businesses are ran in positive finding solutions. Okay. People that have success in this industry are people that are willing to find solutions, not people that are willing to make complaints. You find an answer, you find a solution, you're going to find a way to be successful and help other people be successful. And I promise you guys, if you, you probably, some of you guys might've messaged me and like, you know, had a problem or whatever. I tried to help you find a solution, right? Try to help you find a solution. Sometimes we don't like those solutions, but we learn right? We learn. So I just, I just want to, I want to tell you guys that because I know some of you guys immediately, as soon as Mexico came out, I'm not going, I won't be able to go. You found every excuse in the book why you won't be there. You can't make it there. You can't promote there. You're not going to reach that rank. And you found you somehow turned some awesome damn trip into a negative. Don't do that to yourself. Quit, get, get that out of your head. Say, I'm going to be there. I'm going to find a way. I'm going to help people be successful and then I'm going to get there. So it's, it comes down to like a mindset and, and what you're willing to get going. Um, the next thing I wanted to kind of talk about um, is I want to kind of go over the qualifications for Mexico and what that means. Um, I want to go over some key ideas. Um, Jamie Pekka talked about a group um, for Going into with duo, you guys, you want to get people started on the experience. Now, Paul did say duo is going to be available for, um, duo will be available to be put in kits. And I believe in like the three step system as well for customers. So that's going to be a game changer. However, do not wait until July 3rd to sign people up for these products. You want to get them started on the system immediately. 
and then transition into duo. Does that mean they can't start off on duo right away after that? No, that doesn't mean that. Does it mean that they're probably gonna have better results if they start off on the experience first? Absolutely. Because their bodies aren't going to go in complete shock. They're going to have a chance to experience what exactly this all led to, all right? How we came into the duo. So I strongly, strongly encourage you guys to not slow down and not, not sign people um, because you think that um, nobody is going to want it right now because the, they want to order the duo. You're not working a smart business if that's what you're doing. If you've told one person to hold off to wait until duo comes out, you are cutting yourself short in what you can do for them. Because the three-step system is what built this business, all right? The three-step system is what built this business and will continue to build this business. Because not everybody's goal is going to be weight loss. Not everybody's goals are going to be the same. And that, guys, I can tell you, it's, it's life-changing. Like, if you're not using these products on a daily basis, maybe you're looking at me like I'm crazy right now. But if you are using these products on a daily basis, I guarantee you know what I'm talking about. They're life-changing. They really are. I take them every single day like clockwork. And I can tell if I miss something. Today, I didn't take my lifestyle mix. And I can tell you that I ate um, more. And I also felt more bloated because I didn't have like all the good juice in my stomach, you know. And that's the reality. Because I hopped in the car, I took my capsules, I hopped in the car and I drove and then I ate Wendy's. I didn't eat that much though. I'm just being honest. I didn't eat that much of it because I got full super quick and that's okay. That's all right. Cause I'm wearing my duo and, and it told me, no, I don't know. Does it do that for you guys? It does that to me. It, like fills me up. I'm like, Oh no, I'm good. Um, but the thing is uh, when I'm talking about duo, um, to anybody, because I'm wearing it, it's a little bit easier for those of you guys that maybe don't have your hands on it yet. You want to share, 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 share everything and anything you can find out there about Duo and the results that you see people having. Um, you know, there are pictures on the Lavelle fan page that are coming through like big time. Um, we want to get people into this group. And what Jamie's talking about, Jamie Pekka was talking about, was that basically the idea is, is to get people that are going to be on the eight-week experience. So don't be adding random customers. They need to be on the eight-week experience to be added because they're going to be prizes. Those people must take pictures, all right, and, and participate in it. They need to participate in it. This is not to be added to our team page, guys, all right? So please don't start bulk adding people to our team page. That's not where it's going to take place. It's going to be in a separate group. And um, I will let you know immediately as soon as the group is set up. I thought somebody was starting to work on it, but I apologize. I've been on two different Zooms um, since that, like I saw some people commenting. Um, but we're going to get a group set up. And then you're only going to add people that are on the actual experience. Okay. And then we're going to cheer them on. There's going to be prizes and all kinds of different stuff. Um, and then what's going to happen is people are going to transition into the duo and track their progress. So there's going to be prizes that we're going to, um, Jamie's going to put out prizes. I'm going to help put out prizes. Um, and we're just going to kind of work this and help everybody. And what this is, what this is really cool though, is that when people have their friends that decide that they want to do it too, they can have their friend that signs up as a customer under them. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome idea, right? Um, so it's going to be a little bit crazy because we do have a lot of people. Um, but the excitement from everybody in the group that's actually using this system is going to be contagious, guys. Like we're explosive contagious. But that's why we have to keep it very strict to only people that are actually using the system and only people that are going to actually record their, their results so that they can earn prizes and so forth. It'll bring out like those inner drives of people. Um, let me go over here and read some of these things so that I actually address some of the stuff that people are asking. How do you find people that want to make money? Here's what I want to tell you guys. 
you absolutely have people on your social media and people that you run into at the grocery store at the restaurant that you just went to that served you um, that want to make money. Do you think that people want to work 20 million hours a day every day away from their families? Everybody wants to make money. That's the, that's the serious yeah. truth. Everybody wants to make money. It's just they don't think they can. They don't believe it. Okay. It's your job to make them believe it. It's your job to show them a vision. Oh, hold on. It's your job to show them and create a vision of belief and hope to them. How do you do that? By sharing testimonies, by sharing what you want to do, what you want to accomplish, by sharing other people that are having success in the business and minus their last name. You don't need to include other people's last names when you're making your post. Why? Because you don't want to tea, like lead other people to other people. You want them to come to you, to trust you, to believe you, to be inspired by you. I challenge all of you guys to make it a daily habit to share one testimony off the Lavelle fan page, to share one positive inspirational quote every single day, Tell at least five people happy birthday, okay? I started typing up this list last night. Um, Amanda Hall had this amazing idea that I learned in India, um, Indiana, um, in which I kind of already did it, but now I'm going to utilize it even more. She takes every single day on the first of every month, she starts with her A's, and she starts commenting and liking on their post. On the second of the month, she goes to the B's. On the third of the month, she goes to the C's. On the fourth of the month, she goes to the D's. And you get the hint, right? What's this do? It creates interaction with each letter of the alphabet with people with that name. Okay. It's kind of overwhelming to just go through the entire list, right? But if you go through one day at a time and you just cover all your A's, all your B's, all your C's, guess what's going to happen? Those people are going to start interacting and seeing your post. So if you just take one letter, one letter a day and work on it. It's going to change who's seeing your stuff because you guys can post all day long. Guess what? Not everybody's going to see it. Probably like, I don't know, like, a, I don't know, like, I want to say like a 10th of the people you have on your Facebook. If you're not growing your network, you're not going to um, do it. I can tell you so many people in Canada have my business card in their hand. Why? Because I talk to everybody, but what if you don't really talk to everybody? How can you get your, your card in people's hands? Guys, start slow. Um, ask a friend if they own a business, if you can put a couple of your cards out there. Lay a success from home magazine, a couple of your business cards there. You know, um, maybe there's somebody that has a nail salon that's personally owned or something that that'll, they'll let you put some of your cards there. Do a drawing, do a free drawing for a three day mini. You know, willing to give, um, to get right, do a drawing on your Facebook, be interactive with people, be willing to sacrifice $25 here and there, um, where you guys can absolutely make that back up whenever you're getting your customers and you're showing people how they can, um, become promoters for free. All right. So let's talk about these free promoter accounts. Free promoter accounts. You can absolutely build your business to a whatever size business you want to. You have the same opportunity as somebody that comes in, except if you come in as a free promoter, you have to work harder. Okay. You have to work harder because you need to sell some of those three day minis and get that upgrade kit. Just because you came in with a free upgrade or free promoter account does not mean you don't need an upgrade kit. You absolutely do because customers and promoters come from people that have tried the product most of the time. Okay. So I encourage every single person that is a free promoter to absolutely 100% start talking about the testimony, start talking about three day minis and set a date for yourself that you are going to place that order for an upgrade kit. Set a date. Let's see what's today, Sunday, Wednesday, you're going to place an order for a three day, or for an upgrade kit. And this is how I would word it on your post. On Wednesday, I'm placing my order. So if you want a three-day mini and you want to try this amazing energy that I've been talking about, you know, what's been giving me the amazing energy that I've been cleaning my house and doing all this stuff, okay? If you want one, you need to let me know by Wednesday because I'm placing my order and I want to make sure I have enough to order, okay? 
now you need to tell every single person that says they want one that they need to send you $25 for you to hold it because you don't want to be ordering extra and be stuck with the products and everything else. Okay. Um, you order it however you want to, but I never use the word pre-sell whenever I'm talking about it posting. I say I'm placing an order on Wednesday and I'm going to have this mini. If you want one, I need you to message me and so forth so that you're the first one to get it. Right. Cause you want to make sure that they know like these are going to go like that. They're going to go quick. And if they want one, they need to reserve one. Um, but promoters are going to come from uh, you showing them that they can do it for free. They absolutely 100% can. I have people that join me all the time that do it for free. And guess what? They're out there. They talk about the three-day experiences. They sell it. They try it. I try to get them to get the experience in their hands as, as quickly as they possibly can so that they have something to talk about. Um, and I can tell you it's definitely, it, it's, it's something that, uh, it's your choice, guys. If you want to build your business, you'll find a way. That's what it's going to come down to. If you need to help with something, you need to ask questions. The team page is a great place to start. Um, and, and everybody is willing to help you. Everybody. Um, hold on one second. Okay. All right. I want to talk about something that's a little bit tough real quick. Um, June. Guys, I'm going to tell you something. I have people that come to me sometimes that tell me they can't get anybody signed up. Um, and they tell me that nobody's wanting to join them. And normally in June, I would say that's normal. Except for this June. We've hit our highest volume that we've ever had as a team. All right. Which for a young team. But this is the highest volume I've ever seen in network marketing ever in June. June, when people are out at picnics, when people are out at the softball fields. Guys, our product is something that everybody can see on your arm, on your body. Like this product is like, for God's sakes, today I was crossing the border and the guy at the border asked me what that was. Like seriously, like people want to know what it is. And people are curious. Yesterday when I was in Canada, some guy was like, what is that? My waitress, what is that? Be willing to talk about what it is that you're wearing. If you're wearing it somewhere, I see Erica's wearing hers on the outer part of her arm. Um, ah, yeah, I see you. Um, that, guys, is a conversation starter. If you're using the product, people are going to ask you. All right? So when people tell me that they aren't getting customers, I ask them, where are you, are you using the product? Are you sharing on a daily basis testimonies? Guys, I have people that are signing five and six people a, a day that have never done network marketing. All right? People that are just coming in brand new to doing this, there is no reason. If you are not signing people, then you have to ask yourself, what am I not doing? Am I growing my network? Am I opening my mouth? Am I sharing testimonies? Am I just trying to sell to people? Because if you're just trying to sell to people, you're not going to. You're not going to. People don't care about what you have to sell. People care what you have to offer them. People care about how you are going to help them. I swear to you that if you can bring value to somebody and make them feel good, that is what's going to help people want to join you. And I get the word, I hear people say the word, I'm discouraged. Well, change your words. Change your words. Because if you are saying you are discouraged, you are telling yourself, I'm discouraged. I'm just not going to do this. But guess what? While you're saying that, somebody over here is saying, I will and I am. Okay? I'm going to tell you, it's ironic because I'm going to show you what shirt I am wearing. I am strong, I am kind, confident, and loving. This is one of our shirts. I can't even read the other thing. Honest, okay? I want you guys to see that. This is one of the shirts that we have in our um, uh, store, which I'm not a big fan of saying, guys, go buy all the clothes in the store. Don't do that. But here's my point of why I shared this shirt. Because what you tell yourself is what you are. 
If you say, and I can't do this, you're not going to. If you say you can, you will. And I, I can't make you. But I can tell you this, I can give you the steps and I can show you how to make this happen because guys, look around you. People are making it happen every day. We have the products. We have the opportunity. So if you're not having the success, then you have to say, do I need to talk to more people? Do I need to share more value? Do I need to care more about the people I'm talking to? And I can promise you this, not one person have I ever signed up as a promoter or even as a customer could say that I don't care. Whenever they message me or I talk to them, they know I care. You guys, I can tell you, every single one of you guys, I might not have signed you up, but you're on my team and I care. And if you came to me and you needed help, by golly, I'm going to do everything I possibly can to help you. I'm one person, though, so I could tell you sometimes it might take a little longer to get back. Um, but all I want is to see you guys succeed. Like, that's it. That's my mission is to see you guys all have success. But nobody can do this for you. Not your sponsor. And trust me, they want it for you. They want it for you too, not because their success that's going to come out of it, because gosh darn it, you have a reason why you joined. All right. And I promise you this if you can just remember and you can keep that as the most important thing for you is your why, like nothing is going to be an excuse for you. Nothing is going to discourage you. You're just going to go out there and make it happen. All right. And I, I promise you that is the gosh darn truth. I get emotional if I start talking too much. Aaron, quit it. <laughs> I love you, girl. Gosh darn it. Um, yes. Oh, Nikki. Nikki, Nikki, Nikki. I see you talking about the challenge group. Did I see you comment about creating it? Did you do that? Nikki, no. Did somebody comment on it? Am I behind? Unmute yourself for a second. Me? Yes, you. I am not creating that. <laughs> no, but I seen you say, I see you there, John. <laughs> You're too red. I'm like that. I'm like, I can't take the lead, guys. I'll help, but I can't take the lead. Um, no, I got, I got goals to hit. <laughs> got a customer signing for the challenge group already. You guys yes. can be using that for the challenge group. Yeah, I already have a customer signing for the challenge group. She's like, I'm in, I'm ready. Um, my niece is already using product. She's in, she's ready. Um, and I'm, I'm doing it by telling them to jump in and get two referrals, ask them to have two girlfriends do it with them. And if they have their two girlfriends sign up with them by the end of the month, they're going to get free product credit on the second, which is the day before Duo releases. So they're going to be able to turn that product credit over to free Duo, you guys. So they're not going to put more money in in July. Isn't that smart? Did you guys hear that? She's getting people to join the challenge group that are getting two friends that sign up. Free product credit for their Duo in July. Genius, genius, genius. That is so smart. That is awesome. Thank you for sharing that because I think that's going to help everybody on your team and everybody else that's on this. That's, that's smart. Um, okay. I see somebody said, um, I'm surrounded by people that don't believe in network marketing. My entire town and my entire hospital doesn't believe in network marketing. Y'all seriously. That's ridiculous. I'm going to tell you something. You get a choice to either be the person that, okay, here's the deal. So I'm just going to tell you, once upon a time, I joined a company and I was part of a company and I sold a product that um, helped, uh, oh hell, it's not against compliance for me to say this, helped your fat go away. All right. Um, and it would suck up your belly. All right. Anyways. Somebody said, Amanda, you can't sell skinny wraps because you're fat. And I said, well, skinny wraps don't help me from being a fat ass. All right. They just help tighten, tone, and firm my skin. But anyways, seriously, that's what I used to do. All right. You sell skinny wraps, but I wasn't a skinny person. However, did I get results? Absolutely. Those things are bomb. But that wasn't the point. 
I made a lot of money with that business, a lot of money. All right. Like four times, five times more than what I ever made as a nurse with that business. And people still didn't believe me, even though I retired from my job and retired my husband and people still didn't believe me. But guess what? Some did and some joined. All right. So I want you guys, whenever you're thinking, oh, nobody believes me, whatever. You keep on going. You prove those people wrong. You don't let that thinking stop you from where you're going to go. Guess what? I had people like that. My entire town, all right, was like, they don't believe in it. They don't believe in it. But guess what? They start to see and they start to believe in it when they start seeing people they know have success with it. All right. And if you don't know those people, you go find them, you network and you tell you find the people that are going to believe you. I don't know half the people. I didn't know half the people that joined me if it wasn't for network marketing, like through Instagram, through going out to the restaurant, it made me talk to people. Um, it made me leave that card when I left, um, the Uber even, or the taxi and give my business card to somebody because they might just want an opportunity you know, to do what I do. And I can tell you guys, it is, it's a game changer. So you just have to continue to build your network. And that's another thing, guys, you can't expect your businesses to grow overnight. Like you can't, yes, you see people come in and they're flying off the handles. Does that mean that you're any less valuable? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. We all start somewhere. In fact, my first 10 months, months in network marketing, I spun my wheels. Like I'd sign customers, I'd sign um, distributors and they'd quit. You'd be like, where are they? Where are they? And thank God I didn't quit. But I'm going to tell you what I did do. I plugged into as many events as I possibly could. I got on calls because I needed to stay inspired. I listened to people that were having success. I did what they suggested. I just kept on doing it. And I took it one step farther. I took the time to do my own research and how to grow my network just by simply Googling Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Tumblr, however you work that thing. Um, talking to people, having events, doing vendor shows, doing fairs, having lots of local or parties. I don't know. We don't have to have parties, guys. In fact, we don't have parties. We have like living room locals. And it's just like where you just come and sit around and talk and nibble on foods and wine if you want. I don't know. Whatever you want. And you just literally just um, thrive after fives. People do that. Um, anybody can do those. Locals, you ten, yeah, I think you have to have a 200K at. Um, but the living room locals, you guys can do. Anybody can do those. Okay. Anybody can. Amanda, can I say something really quick? Yeah. <clears throat> so I am um, new. So please bear with me if you've been at this for a long time. Like I might not know what I'm talking about, but um, what I wanted to say is this. Some of you who are concerned about people don't believe in network marketing. Um, I know that there's comments where people say, well, I've heard of that before, but it's a crack patch or I've heard of this, that, or the other. And people have these miss. Um, understandings of what our products are and what our company is about. And I just want you guys to know a lot of the reason that those things are derived and a lot of the reason that people think those things is because of misinformation. It has nothing to do with anything that our company or our product has done. It has to do with fear and it has to do with people being misinformed. Unfortunately, but fortunately, we have the opportunity, every single one of you, the 68 people that are on the Zoom right now, all of us have the opportunity to reverse that mentality and reverse those attitudes. There are also people out there that you have all heard it, the get rich quick, the people that are going to tell you anything and everything you want to hear just to make a buck. That's your job. Your job is to make sure that that's not what you're doing and that you are informing your potentials so you can help them get results. Because if you show somebody a picture and say, this duo is going to make you lose 65 pounds in a week and you're going to look like this supermodel, guess what? When, you use, when they use that duo and they purchase it, they're going to hate you and they're going to hate our company because you gave them misinformation. 
So take this time to educate yourself so you can educate others, so you can build customers for life and create yourself a residual income. Yeah, That's because the truth, the truth here is, and Aaron, you know, that was, that was so spot on. I can't even say the truth is guys, is like, you want to basically, um, you want to share this, these products in a realistic light. Like you want to say, look, this is what's been going on with me. These are the changes that I've made. No, I'm not perfect. Do I know the exact number of pounds or inches or anything like that you're going to lose? No, because here's the thing. You don't know if people are going to do it the way they're supposed to. Guys, I take care of patients all the time in the hospital that don't even take their blood pressure medicine, walk around with blood pressure 200 over 100, but yet they still don't take their medicine that is going to help their blood pressure come down. You know, people don't take what they're supposed to do. Um, they don't follow directions. Nobody follows directions very well, um, even if it says it clear as day. And people want a miracle. So yes, they will eat Wendy's on their way home from Canada in the car, even when they're taking their duo, and then they'll complain to you why their duo is not working. Okay, so just expect like under deliver, like under promise, but let the product over deliver for them. Okay, um, but I never say, just a rule working in health and wellness field, I never say um, how much weight they're going to lose because you don't know. You don't know how compliant they're going to be. You can just say what the benefits are um, and what the product helps with um, and so forth. And there is actually a compliant thing in our back office under notifications that if you want to take a look at the exact wordings and what it can do and so forth. I don't talk about ketosis whatsoever at all when I'm talking about duo. I just say the duo has ketones in it. Okay. Um, and that's just something that I'm 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 saying. And the reason why you can follow whatever the things say in the um, back office, but you're working into medical complaints, Com uh, medical claims when you start talking about ketosis. So just don't use that word. Um, yes, Erica, and your hand up. Yes, sorry. Well, I, I didn't want to interrupt you. Um, I actually, I just wanted to say something because I know there was a couple girls that made a comment about how, um, it's been hard to sign people or just to in general reach out to people. And I know I've seen a couple of those posts um, actually in a couple of our pages. And I like for the longest time, like because of my job, I'll, I'll just admit this um, because of my job, I thought it was really weird for me to be wearing my DFT and for somebody to say something to me at work. Um, and I know, Amanda, you told me a long time just ago just to get over that. <laughs> but um, it actually, um, it hasn't paid off yet, but I believe it's going to. Um, I just happened to work yesterday. Um, and let me back up a second. Um, I work for Enterprise Holdings, so we have to, we have a very strict dress code as far as what we're supposed to wear, um, how we're supposed to dress, talk to people, so on and so forth. Um, so being in a very very professional setting, um, yesterday I just happened to have um, my duo on, and you could see it. Um, and I had three different customers that, while I was checking in their cars, say something to me. Now, granted. I couldn't actually go into talking to them about it, like outside of, oh yeah, no, I love it. It's great, you know, because um, they had heard of it or they had tried it before. Um, but I went ahead and I said, hey, you know, I definitely would like to talk to you about this later. Um, I'll find you on Facebook um, just because, I mean, because of our policies. So, um, and I didn't want to get in trouble, to be honest. <laughs> um, so, my whole thing is don't be afraid to talk to people um, just in general, even if it's a, if it's like a short blurb and then go back later and find them on Facebook because all three people that I talked to yesterday, I found them on Facebook. I messaged them. I said, Hey, we were talking yesterday. I'm sorry. I couldn't, you know, I couldn't talk to you more about it. Um, and I'd like, I'd actually like to sit down and talk to you more if I could. Um, two of them have messaged me back. Two of them are getting many experiences. And the third one, um, 
he has yet to message me back, but um, he's a regular of mine. So knowing my love, he'll probably just talk to me at work. <laughs> yeah, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. Um, but I know that that's something that like I've really struggled with just in the past. Um, and I know Amanda, you, you know, we've talked about that, but for anybody else who talks about that, because it's one of those things as far as getting out of your comfort zone, um, don't be afraid to do it. Um, even, even if it is something that, you know, you, you have to go back and say, Hey, yeah, I'll just put you on Facebook later <laughs> and I'll bring it up later. Yeah. It, it makes that process longer, um, and getting in touch with them and everything, but it pays off, you know, granted, I talked to them yesterday and they, they actually ended up messaging me, messaging me back today. But, um, I know I'm not the only one that struggles with it, but I've had to really change things around mindset wise. And like Amanda was saying, you know, stay focused on being positive. Yeah, I didn't know that they were going to message me back. I figured they probably would have ignored my message <laughs> and said, uh, she's just the enterprise girl, you know, who has the stupid patches on her arms. But, you know, it does, it, it can make a difference. And I was very positive and I stayed positive about it. Um, and I think that is really key. Like you were saying, man, is, is just to stay positive about it. And ignore everybody else and their stupid negative bullshit. Sorry. <laughs> Now you're dropping the, I'm a bad influence on you. Um, I see that somebody asked about the duo. Um, Lisa said that she wouldn't do the duo um, until they've done the regular Thrive experience. I mean, here's the thing. There are going to be people, guys, that no matter what you say, no matter how much you recommend that they start with the normal Thrive experience, they're not going to. Um, so I think that going into that, now experiencing what the duo is going to do, I'm going to recommend that they start with the Thrive Experience. Um, and if they refuse to do it that way, and they're so diligent about it, and by golly, they can go into the duo if they want. Um, but I'm going to recommend that I do suggest that they start with the Thrive Experience and then add the duo in after they've utilized it, at least for a couple weeks, at least, at minimum. But that's just how I'm going to go about it after listening to Paul this weekend. Um, Lisa may change that you know, her own perspective on it. And here's the thing, guys, we really don't know um, what, how it's going to go and, and, you know, how people are going to start off on it whenever they've never used the other, like they've never used the regular experience or anything. They might get amazing results. They might get like, whoa, holy moly results. Um, or they might take a little bit longer for their bodies to get used to the eight week experience that the rest of us have already had. So I think that's just going to amount to a matter of time. Um, had a small handful of people being turned off by the shake or by feeling sick after taking it. How do you convince them? First of all, they're probably feeling like crap because their body is like had a bunch of junk in it. I'm just going to be honest with you guys. The reality of it is the shake, um, the lifestyle mix. If there's a texture situation, which I can't even, I don't even know. I hear people talk about that, but I'm like, it's micronized. Um, if they drink milkshakes, have them throw it in a milkshake. Like, you know, I mean, I would rather see people get it in there somehow, some way. Um, they can also, another way is, is to have them add more um, milk or water, depending on what their preference is going to be. Make it thinner, make it thicker, whatever it might be. I've heard of people sifting it um, as well. Also mixing it up and letting it sit for a minute because it's going to get thinner um, whenever they do that, or it's sometimes a little bit thicker, but let it sit there for a minute before they use it. Um, I do not recommend making it bef the night before because there are probiotics in that, um, and you don't want them to sit for too long, normally within a half hour of making the lifestyle mix. And also I see people making them into like um, little food bar thingies or whatever too, like little protein bites or whatever. Um, so people having like an upset stomach, feeling sick or whatever. First of all, those people probably need to cut their serving in half. Okay. They probably need to cut their serving to a half a pack, not a full pack, um, and find what their right combination is going to be. Um, but 
let them know that their body is it's helping their digestive health guys. So it, sometimes people are very, very toxic and have been eating like crap. And those people, it's probably going to take their body a little bit of time. Me, I eat it or I drink mine and I have to go to the bathroom. So I'm good to go though. I'll take that. Because Amanda, I have something for that. Um, yeah. I experienced a little bit of a queasy tummy the first couple of days that I was taking it too. Um, I'm going to attribute that to, I don't take a Tylenol on an empty stomach. Okay. I've never been able to take vitamins on an empty stomach either. So, um, what I found is that if I drink it and I do, I don't put it in milk. If I do it in milk, it's too much. So I'm doing like chocolate and water. Um, and I'll do just five, four or five ounces, get it down. And then I'll eat a breakfast. And if I eat a breakfast and then just drink some water, I feel fine, but the first two days I wasn't eating a breakfast. I was grabbing like a cracker or granola bar because I really wasn't hungry and I wasn't grabbing a pro like protein. And so if I'll grab like eggs or something like that or um, toast with peanut butter on it, it's it was much better. Now I'm like three weeks into this and I can, um, maybe even more than that now, but I can just go like normal. So I'm not eating until lunch again. But the first couple of days it was a little bit much. And I've had a couple of clients tell me the same thing. So they've been doing that getting some water just doing half of a shake not a whole one and then getting some protein and they've been fine but I think it's just we're not used to taking things on an empty stomach or that much of good stuff either because if there's some really good stuff in there mm -hmm. I agree I think that's a great recommendation there's probably a lot of people that have that um, like that have been doing that too because I'm I'm not a breakfast eater so um, I know I don't even remember what it was like when I first started but I can say like, it, it's never bothered my stomach. It's always been pretty good. Uh, I've done pretty well with it, but I drink a lot of smoothies. So that's not something, you know, but some people are, it's an adjustment. Like some people are just like, no, um, I, I seen where somebody, and I don't know where it's at. Um, somebody talking about, uh, it ex being expensive and people that back out. Okay. And then there's somebody else asking about people that quit people that, don't answer people that don't try people that join okay here guys I'm gonna be honest you can't drag people so I gotta say about that you can't drag people you can encourage them you can reach out to them but at some point in time you have to let go I love you all I don't want to see any of you let go but I'm not gonna beg you to get on a zoom I'm gonna hope and I'm gonna pray for you but I'm not going to beg you to get on a Zoom. I'm not going to beg you to get on a training. I'm not going to beg you to go to a local. I'm not going to beg you to go to the Lavelle fan page and like the fan page, um, follow the fan page, share the fan page. I'm not going to beg you to do that stuff. I'm going to say, hey, guys, this works. This is the proven system. This is what we can do. Um, but at some point in time, you have to move on from those people that aren't doing anything. Okay? The people that are going to make every excuse in the world why they can't, if they're not willing to listen to a solution, then you need to just keep on going. You can say, can I suggest how I can show you how to get it for free? Do you have a couple of friends that might want to try this? And then maybe offer their friends like a, a three-day mini for like $5 off or something. You know, um, get that mini in those friends' hands and guess what? They might just have two people. A customer can sign up for free never order a single product get two referrals that order and get that free product on the second of the month you guys do you realize how powerful that is so every person that says it's too expensive show them how to make it for free they just got to pay shipping 12.99 all right show them find be the solution maker for those people that say it's too expensive find a way what product do you want rest okay Rest is $50, so let's find a way to help you get that product for free. Be willing to help them find solutions, and I promise you, you'll get a better result out of the people that say that it's too expensive because they like that word free, <laughs> all right? Trust me, they like that word free. Um, let's see. Oh, pyramid scheme, I tell them to go look that up. I'll just be honest. I say go look that shit up, then come back and talk to me. Because pyramid schemes don't have products. End of story. How about you go look at my hospital that was getting ready to file bankruptcy a couple years ago? 
All right. How about you go look and see who's making the money there? Because I get, I'll guarantee you the nurses that work 24 million hours a week aren't making the money. All right. But I bet you the people sitting behind the desk that are making all the rules are making all the money. Okay. Let's talk about pyramid schemes whenever we actually know what the meaning is. That's what I tell people that tell me about pyramid schemes. Here's the thing, guys. You can't break my belief. I've seen what the product can do. I know what the product can do. I know what the business model can do. And when you start believing in what this industry can do, those words will never phase you again. All right. I promise you that. Like when, pump, when people say pyramid scheme, I say that pyramid scheme sure is paying my bills. It's paying a whole bunch of bills too that I know of on my team. All right. Every single week that's buying groceries for somebody. That's paying for somebody's um, clothes. They just bought their kid for school. That's paying for somebody's electric to stay on. That's the reality. Your belief has to be bigger than their, uh, like their disbelief. All right. I promise you when your belief becomes bigger than what somebody's words and doubts are, then you don't, it's never going to phase you one bit. So have that belief, find that belief. If you guys don't have it, you have to find it. And that is going to be a matter of if tomorrow you lost your job, what are you going to do? If you work outside the home or if maybe you don't, maybe you stay home, maybe your significant other is the, the you know, majority of the income. Okay, what happened if he lost his job tomorrow and there was no severance pay? What would you do? You would find, it's like a fight or flight response, right? You'd find a way. Well, instead of waiting for that time, you find it now. You find it within yourself to make it happen. I can tell you story after story after story, but none of it's going to matter until you yourself find that fight in yourself. I promise you that, guys. I promise you. I've been down the road where I felt so beat down that I didn't know what I was going to do. And guess what? I found this amazing opportunity that I had to throw away what I had worked so hard for. I had to take the risk of judgment by people that I cared very much about. But here's the thing. I believed in what I was going into. And because of that, I got to where I'm at now. All right? And not everybody is going to agree or believe in what you believe. All right? But you have to find it within yourself too. So that's what I have to say about that. The pyramid scheme question, they got, they got better. You got better things to do. Go build your business. Don't worry about those people. Seriously, prove them wrong. That's all I got to say about that. Um, not sure why. New grant master. Um, yeah, I, I would suggest that they had the regular DFT first, but like I said, um, July 3rd, supposedly the duo is going to be released every, do not, <laughs> guys, I cannot tell you enough. Like you are seriously going to hurt your business if you don't get people like to go right now, um, and get started because they, there's going to be people that they need to be sampling these packs out to, all right, to help build their business, to help get those people ready for duo and so forth. So make sure you're telling people like, don't wait till July 3rd. Don't, don't like, that's the worst thing you can do for your business. You need to get that stuff out into people's hands now. So I think it's just going to be, um, a matter of, yeah, people are going to start with Duo regardless. I mean, there's, there's nothing anybody can do about that, all right? If it's available for order, people are going to order it. I can promise you that, especially when they see the results out there. So I, I'm not going to be able to stop people and anybody else. Mm. Why is the shake not every day thing? Okay, so here's the thing. The company, um, I actually emailed them about this at one point in time, and I wanted to know the clarification for it. So because it's for your digestive health, um, it's only, you know, you only need to 
for the experience, take it three days a week. That's just because you're, or four days a week, because your belly doesn't absolutely need to have that stuff every day. However, if your goal is for weight loss, um, it is better for you to take a full packet every single day. And that's why there's the tone pack plus DFT. So you get two boxes of the lifestyle mix whenever you get the tone pack with DFT. And it is a little bit more, but that's why you want to teach people how they can get theirs for free so that they aren't complaining about that. <laughs> um, but I can tell you, like, I'm willing to pay it because I, am seeing the results, but it's just the fact that your body doesn't absolutely have to have all of that stuff. It's just for, good for your digestive health. So they only recommend you have like recommend four days. So you can do that four days on three days off. You can do it every other day. You can do a half every day, however you want to do that. However, people are having the better results for me personally. I take it every single day. Um, let's see. Yeah, so that's how the half a shake a thing day started is because um, you your body only needs um, like four days worth of it. Um, but a half a shake a day, if you want to, um, or one every other day or four days on three days off. So that's why only 16 come in a box. Um, okay, I am. All right. So I answered all the questions, I think. Um, but so let's get some people um, ready for free accounts. Let's get people set. Oh, I did say one more thing I was going to talk about, which was the Mexico trip. So the first qualifications is three customers and three promoters and 12K. So for those of you that are not yet 12K, which I know there are a lot of you, I want you to focus on who you can help go VIP 800, VIP 1600. Do you realize that two VIP 1600s is right around 4K? If you help six people in the next month get focused on that, guess what? You're 12K. You help six people focus on going VIP 800, VIP 1600. Six, you're 12K. Imagine that. Doesn't that make that 12K a little bit more possible? Because guess what? Those six people are going to end up buying, getting, like, they're going to be helping a lot more than just the people that come in and get their, like, VIP 1600. And then their VIP 1600 people are all going to be going after VIP 1600. Boom, boom, boom. Now you're 40K because duplication is key. All right. So make your focus to go find those people that want to go VIP 800, VIP 1600. Teach those people, guys. Make that your number one goal. If you want to go to Mexico, 12K, two qualifying months. Guess what? If this month is like, I really don't know if I can make that happen, well, you've got July and you've got August, and you can make it happen. And guess what? If you don't, you came awfully damn close and then there's going to be another trip. All right. But here's the thing. You're going to be making a heck of a lot better check. All right. So win, 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 win. It's all winning, right? It's all winning and duo releases on the third. So trust me that VIP 1600 for multiple people is totally possible. All right. So get out there and talk to people and tell people how you can help them join for free, how you can help them get started for free and then turn that into money. Turn that into solutions. Turn that in ways that people are thriving for free, your customers, your promoters. Um, show them goals. Show them belief. Show them that you're not going to quit, that you're going to keep on going. You're going to keep on showing up. You're going to keep on believing in them. If they want to help, then they have it, guys. We have a whole team page. You don't need to know it all. All right? Pin every single person in that new, that pinned post, which we do need to revi revise a little bit here and there. But for the most part, it's working. Okay. So just keep on tagging people in it. Keep on tagging them. Keep on plugging them in. Keep on going to the Lavelle fan page and liking it. Keep on sharing the Lavelle fan page um, stories. Keep on plugging into these kind of things. Keep on asking questions. Keep on staying positive and keep on helping each other. All right. I promise you a whole bunch of ideas is better than just one. So I love you all.
it's been a half or been a, an hour. I'm gonna let you guys go because I know some of you guys are still pushing from end of the night paychecks going up. Um, so we are going to what is the average 12k check? Um, that just varies. That varies um, on how many person enrolled you have like that have hit 4k because you get check matching. Um, and that just varies. I would say, I'm not going to say a specific number because I, I don't, I, I know people that make in every variation there. So it's just going to depend. Um, Michael, are you, um, have you hit 4k yet or VIP 800, VIP 1600? Not yet. Focus on that first. Then we'll talk. <laughs> Focus on that first. I swear to you, I promise you, ask any single person that's ever promoted on this page with me or on this Zoom right now or on here, period, especially if you've been here for a while, that is my rule of thumb. Focus on your VIP 800 VIP. Because if you guys, here's the thing. If you don't focus on that, then you're never going to find the stress of why you should be teaching your team to focus on that. Okay. And you want to hit every goal and celebrate every goal as you hit it. I promise. So yes, go. Yes, absolutely. What Nikki just said, guys is golden. If you're outside your VIP 800, VIP 1600, go after two and two, try to get that VIP 800 for yourself. Okay. Cause your check is going to grow. You're going to be getting fast start bonuses. You're going to be getting customers. You're going to get paid on that retail. All right. And then before you know it, you're going to be teaching those two people that came in how to go VIP 800, VIP 1600, and you're going to go 4K. Then you're going to teach those people that come into their team how to do it again. And then you're going to go 12K. The more your team has that success, the more you keep on going, even whenever you might not have hit your goal, you're going to find the success. So that was a great tip. So yes, and we will, um, uh, yeah, and that's another thing too. I set that same goal two and two weekly is what I aim for. So I try to aim for more, but two and two is what my goal is every week. Um, so I'm going to end this and I know Erica, you asked me to stick around, so I'm not going to hang up yet, but um, I'm going to end the recording for you guys. And I will post it as soon as I get it uploaded to YouTube.